Aloha guys, for all you gardeners out there that are looking to take your garden to the next level, we're going over landscape edging today. So we got the experts here at City Mill to talk about how we can give our garden that extra kick. Landscape edging, what is it? Another way of differentiating your flower bed from your lawn. It also gives your guide as to where you're gonna be cutting grass so your lawnmower doesn't go over and your weed eater gives a nice straight edge. Ron, walk me through, what do I gotta do here? Clear some of the, the soil away from there just so you can get an area for scallop edging to sit. Come on down to this one, you're all good there. That one's all set. Look at this, we, we, we get dirty on high now. Okay, we don't use no stunt mud, no stunt dirt. You're getting to the point that you can set your second one. Your edging you wanna have sitting right up against each other. The soil, you just wanna be down far enough so that this edging is buried about halfway in. You're gonna put this one, just lay it right up against the next one, slide it into place. Now we see we got a little edge, not gonna quite take a full piece. Okay, so that means we gotta cut it. And to do that, they just showed me how to do this. You need a mason's hammer. I'm gonna show you guys how to cut it. This is how easy it is. Oh! oh, oh, oh. Nice. That's how easy it is here at City Mill. All right, now we pray it fits. Woo! Right on into place. And all you need Look to do is backfill that. everything. Look at that, gang. That took me two minutes, and now I'm like a full-blown landscaper here. Awesome, dude. Thanks, Ron. You use the mason hammer, and you also use the trowel picked up at any city mill, on citymill.com. Now, the, the scallop brick, you can pick up at any city mill except for the wine ice store. I believe I did this. This took me less than two minutes. Come down and check them out over here at City Mill. Brought to you by City Mill.